Hey guys, so today we're gonna do my usual makeup, my routine makeup, my everyday makeup, I don't know how to say. I'm doing that because I've seen a lot of comments on my Instagram, TikTok, YouTube, everywhere, like, Renata, how are you doing your makeup? Actually, I don't know what I will say about makeup because I'm not a guru of makeup and I'm not a professional in makeup, I'm just doing something with my face. My tips probably will be not the best one. And let's start, and so I just wake up. I look bad. I know, so don't remind me about this. So when I'm doing my makeup, I always wearing something with an open neck because when you're doing your makeup, you need to touch your zone here too. So the first thing without what I can do my makeup is without a band on my hair. I mean, wait a minute, where is it? I don't know, where is it? So I'm running like this to fix my hair and my bags and I'm fixing with my tie on the back. The first tap is a tone corrector, it's by some around. So I put some here, 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 and a little bit on the nose. With my fingers, I'm blending, blending? I don't know, I just like, you know, you see what I'm doing. My foundation, to be honest, is not really my favorite foundation because I'm still searching for my, I'm looking for my favorite foundation. I'm using a Saint Laurent foundation at this time. I'm always using another foundation every month. When it's done, I'm buying another foundation because I'm still looking for another, for a favorite one. If you have some foundation recommendation, just let me know. So I don't really like to put a lot of foundation, so I'm just like a little bit and I'm using of course a beauty blender like everyone nothing new I told you I just doing like a normal girl's makeup which every girl doing and just blending on my face blending on my face that sounds weird that's weird Actually, I'm lying. I like this foundation and this time. It's kind of good and light. I can do my makeup for 10 minutes super easy, like fully good makeup. And I can do my makeup for one hour, few hours. I don't know. It just like depends. If I'm hairy, if I'm super hairy, so I can do my good makeup for 10 minutes. But if I'm not hairy, I can do my makeup for hours. Don't forget about eyes and lips either and about your neck. Just a little bit. Perfect. I think this is the funniest part when you just like with your foundation without any shadows. Our next step is doing eyeshadow. So my favorite eyeshadow is all by Dior. So I'm usually using this or this. Oh my god, it's not eyeshadow, my bad. I will mix it. I will use this to eyeshadow. And let's start from the light one, so from the pink. I was doing makeup since like 13 by myself because I was really into like modeling everything and I was learning how to doing my makeup. I've never paid attention to my brush. What I wanted to say that brushes is really important in your makeup because I remember when I was like in the travel with my friend and she told me like, Renata, you should try this brush and I'm like, huh, it doesn't matter. And I was using the same eyeshadow what I was always using it, but it was another brush and it's absolutely changed my makeup at all. So brush is really important when you're doing makeup. Don't save your money on the brushes. You can save better on eyeshadow, but never save your money on the brushes. If you have a good brushes, you never will do like bad eyeshadow. So I'm using the light colors right now, like mixing these three colors. So I'm putting this on my eyelid. I hope I'm doing this right. I'm prun. I prun I'm pro. Ooh, I'm pronouncing this right, so... And today we're going a little bit more darker, this color, and probably mixing with this one. And we're going on this part of eyelid. And the bottom. I'm using in another eyeshadow palette this color. I like doing like a little transition from like lighter colors to darker. And I'm doing on this part all the time. And don't forget about this. And right now I want to add some golden on the middle of my eyelid. I like when my eyes fighting, so after I will add some more highlighter too. And right now we're using another brush, like a little bit more little. And I will use darker color from here to make my eye, I don't know, just like more 
her shadows and the same at the same spot. This looks kind of ugly right now, but just trust the process. So the next part of my makeup, I don't really like eyeliner because it's look kind of heavy on my face and it's like more evening or go out makeup. So for my daily makeup, I'm using just a black color of eyeshadow and doing like super easy eyeliner with my, I don't know, with this brush. Like pretend this eyeliner, but it's with eyeshadow. And it's super easy to practice doing eyeliner with the eyeshadow. So I finished with my eyeliner. I know it's not really like amazing eyeliner eyeliner you ever seen in your life, but it's like how I'm doing that. Next step is just doing some shadow on my face finally. It's my favorite part. I'm using your brush for this and I will use, I don't know <laughs> how you can see I have a lot of Dior, it's my favorite brand and using for my makeup, always Dior, I don't know, I just really like it so I'm using this bronze for my face and I like doing shadow because I don't know, it's just like my favorite part of makeup just make sure you're blending really well I don't know, nothing interesting on this part, just like blending my face, doing some shadows, some bronzer. I don't know, I'm doing always on this part too. The neck. Okay, the next step is a concealer. I'm doing this after this because I like fixing everything after like my eyeshadow. I don't know, I'm just putting somewhere. I think it's wrong, but just how I'm doing that. And blending again. And after I did my concealer, I'm using Huda Beauty Baking. Now I'm doing baking, so I'm using another Huda Beauty Blender for this. And just... I don't know really how to do this right. And I just put it under my eyes. First right here. A little bit here. And again right here. Nice! I don't even know what I'm doing, but I'm doing something. Always trying to do something and you will find your way how to make your makeup. That's how I find it. While my face is baking, I'm using right now a blender but with a little brush and contouring my nose. I'm doing this like super easy way, just like contouring right here, right here. And don't forget about this part. And here. That's it. So while my face is baking, I can do my lips and I will do with a this pen. So I just painting around my lips, doing a little contour, like not a little, about like all around lips. And I like blending with my fingers. So now I will use a mock stone a little bit more darker again around my lips. Okay, perfect. And now I'm using lighter color, like to fill out everything. So it's NYX. I'm done with my lips and I will add some gloss, like a little bit, just like for making my makeup a little bit fresh. That's it. And this is, again, this is Dior and this is Sleep Maximizer. It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. We almost done. So we need to make my eyelashes. So now let's take off our blender. No blending for me anymore. While I'm doing my eyebrows, I'm just using the amazing by Too Faced Bro Gel. I really like it. I'm using this for, I don't know, for a few years and I'm still using this, my favorite one. Just brushing my eyebrows. That's it, how I'm doing my brows. Because I don't like doing not natural. I like when my brow is super natural, so I'm doing like on the top. That's it, I'm doing my eyebrows. And right now, we're doing blush, some blush, right? So again, Dior. I don't like big brushes for this, so I'm using a little brush because I like to do this like contour. 
Let's do a highlighter. My favorite part. Yes, with a highlighter, everything looks so good. And I'm using the favorite one is from Benefit. This is the best highlighter I ever tried, so I really recommend it. Just putting on my nose on the bottom, like a little circle. Look how good is it! And we're doing a line, like to make our nose super thin. I love it! Oh my god! I told you this, I will add more highlighter on eyelid after. And going to eyelid here. And using a paint brush, special for highlighter, this one. Amazing! Oh my god! I actually forget about the pen for my eyes. I'm always doing this, so that's making my makeup again fresh. So I put it here. And let's do lashes. So for lashes, I just using mascara. But before mascara, I using this one. It's like primer from Dior. Again, how you can see, I'm obsessed with Dior. This is really make your lashes so much more longer. I really like it. So just put on my lashes first before mascara. Okay. My lash right now is wide and after again I'm using mascara by Tear by the same collection like this primer. Just finishing my makeup with mascara, that's it. And I'm never doing mascara on the bottom lashes because I don't really like it. Just like super a little bit like boom, boom, that's it. I think I'm done with my makeup. Finally! Yay! We did this! And now just like fix my hair and let's see the full look. Because without hair, it always looks ugly. I don't know why. But hair makes you look so much different with the makeup too. So that's how it looks like. Okay, that's it. I don't really know why you was watching this because my makeup is super weird and typical. Um, but anyway, thank you for being here with me. Bye!